turn the boat. 185 miles from land. On the 107 foot saga. So you better start reporting to me. There's people downstairs. What is going on? <laughs> Shut it down! Just shut it down now! Shut it off! <laughs> Get Oli out of there! Shut it down. Is it on fire? No. <coughs> Starboard side clutch. Oh, God. I think it's the clutch burnt out. The smoke just starts pouring up. Oh, God. You have to get it. The source of the toxic smoke, a burnt out clutch. My heart just dropped. Fire is the most dangerous thing that can happen on a boat. It's not flooding. We caught it just in time. The clutch is a padded ring that transfers power to the hydraulic system. As the protective padding wears over time, the shaft slips, causing friction, overheating, then fire. If the guys wouldn't have caught it, would eventually got to the hydraulic oil, erupted in an explosion, and we would all been dead. So thank God that the guys caught it. Although a quick response avoided a disaster. We were dead in the water, literally dead in the water. Jake has to shut down fishing until the clutch is repaired. I'm worried about the owner, and I'm, now I've got to worry about this, and this is a huge issue. I've got the owner breathing down my neck. If I don't catch the crab on time, he starts taking it. At the start of the season, I, I hate to say it, but I'll have to get somebody else to help you harvest the crab, which would be less for you and the crew. Boat owner Lenny Herzog threatened to strip away Jake's quota if he didn't produce. Oh, dear God. One crab. Not good. Already off to a slow start, this delay could cost Jake and his crew their season. I know my engine room. I got no problem getting my hands dirty. Now it's do or die as captain and crew attempt to make short work of a major repair. Captain Jake Anderson is eight hours into a major clutch repair. After it filled the boat with toxic smoke. Yeah, we, oh, the the time. 
Until Jake completes the fix, the saga is just chewing up clock. After successfully installing a new clutch, I kicked that fire in the jaw. I said, out. <laughs> the young skipper can get back to fishing. It's 8 21 p.m. You guys ready to haul the first string of the day? Yeah. Woo! Let's go. Nice toss, Mr. Gribble. We are going to succeed, damn it, we are. Come on, baby! Coming up. We need more than this. Nothing. 33 hours. It's all paradise. There's nothing in this. 